Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the vlog. If you're new to the channel, I am Steve Chapman of Fishing Florida Radio and well tomorrow, right now I'm just getting ready for tomorrow's episode or tomorrow's vlog. We are heading south. We're going to do some saltwater fishing. Some saltwater fishing that I think you'll be interested to see. Why? Well, we're going to go fish with a great friend and kind of someone that I really look up to. Stick with us, subscribe, hit that con uh, hit that like button and the notification button so you know when we have a new one and send us a comment. Tell us what you think. I'm trying to reply to all of them, answer questions if you have questions, and of course watch till the end. I'm going to tell you how to get hold of dart spins from his company. This is going to be the episode where I send out dart spins to people. You'll have to come. You'll have to tell me who you are and send us a, an email or Facebook. Get on Facebook, but we'll tell you how to do that at the end of the end of this uh, episode. So just hang out, sit back, get a cold one. I mean, soda or beer, whatever is your preference. But get ready for some fun. Let's get it going, man. Let's do this. here behind me right there sits a man innovator creator lure designer someone that is in a different realm of fishing and a great friend great dad I'm happy and excited to introduce you to someone you should already know but let's go say hi Maybe he's not here. But we know his gate code to get into his house. Oh, I can't put that on the camera. Wouldn't you like this? Two hours later. Well, I'm very pleased here. I'm with my great friend Steve Chapman from Florida Fishing Radio, our best friend Nathan Wyatt, and we should have our friend Tim Simos joining anytime soon on the water anyway. The I'm new boat. I'm very excited because that's the new boat. That's going to be the, the maiden trip, right? I want to cast some of my new prototypes on my new boat. Love it. Love it. Huh? <laughs> That's a sexy color, by the way. <laughs> you don't like it, huh? <laughs> so 350 wire. The wire goes like this and like this. Here we have the weight. Here we have a hole so we can put a rattle. So it's perfectly silent. Or with a rattle, we can make it noisy. You know, we have good strong loops. So it's made for that. Okay. Oh, please get crushed. Oh, the dead alive swimmer. That is a 
sexy looking mate. Dead alive. Dead alive. Because when you use that bait with a weighty loop, if you let it drop, it's gonna stay like this. It's brilliant with the, the weight like this on the floor. So you can play a dying bait, swim it, twitch it, jerk it, and let it drop. And if you use a not weighty hook, now it swings super slow on the top. And when you stop it, it turns sideways and floats like this, like a, a dying bait. So, dead alive. That's why we're, we're opposite in both options. Weighty hook and not weighty hook. By the way, that's old trusty. Upper. I guess they're catching some African pompano out there now, huh? Box. Box. Yeah, no, no, it's not in the box. Yes. Where did it over? Very, very nicely. So now you have a floating and a sinking one. A floating shrimp and a sinking one. And both of them complement very much each other. The floating, you can, like I do, just use it on a regular, just a small single hook, strong. You can put that on a jig head if you want. You can put that on a drop shot rig. You can do, I mean, many things. Behind the float. You know, if you fish and none of the docks, when the snook or other fish are feeding on, on shrimp uh, at night, <laughs> What you want to do better than that, honestly? Yes, Captain Tim Samos. There you go. Captain Tim, we're coming back. Coming up front. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, why not? That's why. How big of a net do you have on the boat, Patrick? <laughs> I have a giant net. <laughs> Okay, we're gonna swing them. I have a, I have a, oh, that's a baby snack. That's okay. Here you go. Yeah, we don't. First fish, and that's on the on the new, on the very new, very very new spool tag. Hold up. Yes. Here you go. Here's the first fish of this box. And with the new spool tech, you know, that's a new design for the fatty with the, the strong tail. The, the tail is the same material as the dart spin, that's called soft tough, super long lasting, new finish, and there you go. So I was wondering, will we start and, you know, break the ice on this boat with a teeny fish? Well, indeed, that's the case. Now let's go for a big one. Yeah, that's uh, one another found said. That's also soft tough material. As the thunder, as the lightning strikes in the background. Oh yeah. You don't need to go fast and have a lot of action.
spinning, I can skip web casting. I'm really not good at that. Neither am I with a bait caster. Huh? I can't do it with a bait caster yet. Yeah. But with a spinning gear, you saw me yesterday, I was putting them in there. Oh yeah, with spinning you have no problem. Yeah, you can't get that. That right there is... Yeah, the jacks are here. That's beautiful there. Like I will never be able to do if I have a quarter ounce. Here you go. There's my. There it is. Well, this is my first fish hooked on my new boat, by the way. <laughs> That's kind of cool. I think it's a snook. Try to go in the mangrove. It's a nice snook. Yeah, it is a snook. Yeah, and meanwhile. Careful. Yeah. Right. Basically, I was able to put a three quarter of an inch. Oh, bye-bye. <laughs> Two full days, not only driving and getting in here in the sun and getting beat up. Uh, you go, you so go. We will, uh, we'll finish this up, but make sure you guys subscribe and click that like button and that notification button too up there on the right or the left. And make sure you just leave a comment and say hello. We appreciate y'all. Everybody, if we haven't ever said that, we appreciate y'all. We got some dart spins to give away, so if you want a dart spin, send us a private message uh, on our Facebook page, facebook.com slash fishing Florida, or send us an email directly. Email at the email is info at fishing Florida radio.com. I'll probably do this over, but remember, take a kid fishing, get your fish on. See you next time. Later.